We got our little truck up to speed here. Hey guys, welcome back to the LaFontaine Classic Car YouTube. Hope y'all have been having a great day. My name is Mackenzie. I'm living the dream over here yet again. Uh, about to show you guys around a new arrival we got. This is a 1950 Ford F1 truck. It is a show winner. It's got a V8 four speed on the floor. Come in, take a closer look, and we'll go for a spin. We like to start off right up front and we'll make our way around town at gorgeous, gorgeous grill. Those are stainless slats running across the front of this, polished up to the nines. Bumper looks immaculate, no dense dings, and the quality of that chrome is A++. Lights look gorgeous, the badging looks gorgeous. That's very cool, these are flushed in there. Very ahead of its time, elegant, elegant. Um, these have cool fenders and a sweet hood, but the hood gets a little bit cooler when you want to open it. You pull that right there, and voila. I apologize, it's a little dark in here. This is our 239 V8. We've got a nice two barrel on top. This is a six volt truck, all enclosed in a nice little battery case over here. Lines look great, belts look great, bunch of original stampings. I'll have to throw in some pictures for you guys. And I'll show you how this hood closes up. Very tight. Kill a fitment on the 50. Whoo, look at them blue steelies with the little dog bowls kept on top. I like the white line Firestones on here too. Our F1 badge that started it all. I think that's the number one selling truck in the world or the country. F-150. Chrome on the handle looks great. These are cool operation. They click right down. Our little step side or wheel tubs over here are in great shape. Paint on this whole truck is killer. What a cool color. Um, this thing, uh, it was some years back, but actually won Detroit Autorama at one of its class um, back when it was just restored. So to do that, you pretty much have to, you know, build a like new truck, and that is essentially what we got here for you today. It has been enjoyed uh, since its restoration, of course, but someone took great care of it. The inside of the bedsides, there's no scratches, dents, or dings. This bed floor is gorgeous. Um, stainless slats breaking it apart, and even all the countersunk hardware holding the bed onto the frame. It's a, all very nice pieces, and I like how this is capped off too. And you even got a bit of rubber keeping your paint safe and a, a nice gentle close. I'll show you the ease of operation. Number two here. <laughs> Just like that. Good and tight. These are very dank. I like those. You got one on either side. Um, no reverse lights on here. Cool little tip out back. And same story going on down this side of the truck. It is a little dark. We do have a nice fuel fill over here. I like the Ford lettering for the center of that. All right, I'll give you guys a peek at what's going on in the interior. Uh, that door card there, the paint is just as nice on the outside of this truck as it is the inside. You see you got new weather stripping all around, um, felts and window seals too. Um, all of the chrome on your door latch and your window crank look like they're brand new parts. You come in and take a look at this interior. First off, killer seat done very very nice shades of gray 
Then you peek over at the dash and we have a couple lovely shades of blue. I love the instrument panel done in that lighter color. Um, we got our speedo, fuel, oil, battery, and temperature for the coolant that is. Little indicator switch on the side to turn your blinkers on. And our three speed on the floor right there. Yeah, this is a fun truck. Ford, 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 Ford. Very cool. This opens down nice and we got here an owner's manual for the old Ford F1. Dig it. Let's take it for a spin. We got a little truck up to speed here. Very comfortable bench seat. This gearbox feels great. It's very tight. And so is our steering. Going through a little bend in the course here. Try out second gear. takes all the bumps very well and it tracks straight down the road and how does it break nice and straight too I dig it cool all these are back lit up nice and beautiful for us and you see guys everything is working um, battery right where we like it oil pressure up here we got fuel gauge and temperature very nice, very nice. Got a little heater down here. I don't know if you heard that kick on there. And this even illuminates for you. Very cool, very cool. And then our blinker just over here and our wiper control is up on top of the dash here, little knob. Nice, firm, clean. I like this little truck all throughout. We got this truck up in the sky now. I want to give you guys a brief walkthrough of the undercarriage. Looks like newer shocks, drum brakes aren't leaking nothing, and all the joints look like good rubber um, and well greased. Uh, frame is solid as hell for a 50s truck. I don't see um, really any rust at all. And sometimes you look at these frame rails and they're heavily pitted and they've been cleaned up. These don't look like they've ever been restored they just look they've just been well taken care of and out of the elements this is very clean um, bottom side of the 239 looking good we got our top loader transmission right behind it that is a good looking hunk of metal um, drive shaft is a three inch steel bit out the back it's cool looking at the bed floor down here Parking brake cables look good. Uh, underside of the cab and all these pinch seams look sweet. Brake lines look new and fresh. Uh, got bump stops up there. Again with the newer shocks. And nicely, nicely done spare tire with the carrier. And clean bumper and tailpipe out the back. Cool. Always my pleasure to show you these old rides, especially this truck today. Um, if you want to know anything more about it, see anything more on it, uh, definitely give us a buzz. It's 248-714-2110. Call us at any time. We'd be happy to share how easy the process can be. Uh, we do shipping, financing. So definitely hit us up. And then uh, I'll put our email number in the description. 
and a link to view the full listing of the truck. That'll be a whole bunch of pictures, um, close-ups of the underside, ins and outs, and a full write-up on it. Thank you for tuning in uh, with LaFontaine Classics here. My name is Mackenzie, and we look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye.